with quadratics, uh, we know the shape of a quadratic, and so we know that uh, we will always have a, a maximum or a minimum point. And of course that depends on whether or not the uh, parabola is opening upward or downward. So we have this little summary here of, uh, of how to identify those extreme values. So if you have a quadratic, and it's written in this form here, um, which some people call standard form, some call vertex form, some graphing form. But if it's in this form here, uh, we know our vertex is at h, k, and that, of course, is where our extreme value of a quadratic will occur. And if I draw a quadratic, it either is like that or like that, and I've got a maximum there and a minimum there, and that is the, the vertex of the parabola. So I know that the maximum or minimum occurs at the vertex, and so that all just depends on whether or not I'm opening downward or opening upward, and that, of course, comes down to the sine of a, the leading coefficient. And if a is positive, we know it's opening upward. And if it's opening upward, then we know we have a minimum point. So the minimum value of the function is f of h equals k. It's that k value. It's the y value of the vertex. And it occurs when x equals, of course, the x value of the vertex. And similarly, if a is negative, then we know we are opening downward. And if we're opening downward, we know we have a maximum. And of course, that also will occur at the vertex. Now that's if you are in this uh, vertex form uh, for your function, but if it's instead in this form, ax squared plus bx plus c, um, then we need to know where that vertex occurs. And a nice shortcut is, uh, is this formula right here, that the vertex of a quadratic is when x equals negative b over 2a. Um, and the reason this is, is you can see in a couple ways, um, but in, if you go through and you complete the square uh, for a function that looks like this, you're going to see that you always have a, uh, a negative b over 2a uh, for h. Okay. You can also see it in the quadratic formula. The quadratic formula is that uh, if a quadratic is uh, set equal to 0, then x is equal to negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac over to a. And we can see the, uh, the, the, that negative b over 2a uh, right here in the negative b over 2a. Okay? That plus or minus then is the offset. That's how much you need to move in order to get to your zeros. So that negative b over 2a, um, if you were trying to remember how to find where the vertex is, if you just think of your quadratic formula, then you, uh, then you can remember that.